Large Animal Medicine The Diagnosis and Treatment of Nitrate Poisoning in Cattle The following presentation is narrated by one of our sponsored students, Dr. Ali Muhammad from the University of Veterinary and Animal Sciences in Pakistan. This is Vet Masna Buzar. Hope you are all doing well. Today, I am gonna discuss with you people a very important and very dreadful case of nitrate poisoning in the cattle. Yeah, just look at the picture. It can be so lethal that it can wipe away your all herd. So please subscribe to our channel to get to get more such uh, videos of the clinical cases and click the bell icon plus comment, share and thumbs up for more videos. Yeah, it is a very dreadful disease as you can see from the pictures. Here, this is, uh, these are all the signs of the nitrate poisoning that your uh, cattle is affected with. Now we are going, um, going to discuss this disease. So first of all, we will uh, discuss the etiology or the causes of the disease. So nitrate poisoning is a rare but important cause of poisoning in cattle. It can occur as a result of eating crops such as brassicas, green cereals or sweet clover that contain high level of nitrate. However, the most common source is inorganic nitrate fertilizers, either directly straight from an open bag via grazing an over fertilized field or via, via water runoff from the heavily fertilized fields. Spring is the most common season for nitrate poisoning. Now what is the mechanism of action of the nitrate poisoning? Nitrate poisoning occurs because the nitrate is broken down to nitrite in the human. In normal circumstances, the nitrite is further broken down to ammonia in the human and is then used by the human microbes to make protein. However, when large amount of nitrate are eaten over a short period of time, the nitrite accumulates in the rumen and is absorbed. Once in the bloodstream, it reacts with iron in the red blood cells so that they can no longer bind oxygen. Here is the mechanism of action of the nitrate toxicity. When your animal ingests high nitrate forage, it goes to the human. Here the nitrate is converted into nitrite and in normal cases, normal circumstances, the nitrate is again converted into ammonia. But when there is excess nitrite, it goes to the blood and binds with the red blood cells and hemoglobin and uh, the hemoglobin is converted into myth methemoglobin. Here is an other picture showing that mechanism of action of nitrate toxicity. The nitrate from the blood, nitrate having excess nitrate in the blood and nitrate converting into ammonia and ammonia is then um, uh, used by bacterial protein and uh, uh, from there in instead and this is the normal mechanism. But when there is excess nitrate in the blood, it results in the toxicity of the nitrate. Now, what are the clinical signs? The signs are usually seen within a few hours of eating the nitrate. The higher the dose, the faster the signs develop. The signs include abdominal pain, scour, weakness, muscle tremors, drooling of saliva. Drooling of saliva is the most important uh, clinical signs in the uh, nitrate poisoning of your cattle. Blue discoloration of the mouth, mouth breathing, collapse, coma and death in the severe cases. Here is again uh, I'm gonna sh uh, show you the mechanism and clinical sign combined in a single slide. 
Now what is the diagnosis? The clinical signs are vague, particularly early on. Early veterinary involvement is therefore very important. If your cattle have had access to nitrate and start showing the signs of illness, get them checked to a registered veterinarian as soon as possible. Nitrate poisoning can be identified using a blood test for either nitrate or methemoglobin, the product formed when nitrate reacts with red blood cells. In severe cases and at PM, the methemoglobin is visible as high levels in the blood results in the blood becoming chocolate in color. Here you can see the lab results of the nitrate, uh, nitrate test. When we take, uh, we take the blood from the affected animal and we do the lab procedure. Uh, in normal circumstances, the color of the blood is reddish. But in case of excessive nitrate or nitrate poisoning, it becomes uh, so red that it looks like chocolate. Here you can see the chocolate like color of the blood. Now what is the treatment of the nitrate poisoning? First of all, remove the source of nitrate. Veterinary treatment with methylene blue can be very effective at reversing the changes in the blood, particularly in the early stages. Slowly inject a 1% or 4% solution of methyl blue into the vein intravenously for of the affected cow. The lower dosage of methylene blue can be used in all species, but only ruminants can safely tolerate the higher dosage. Here is the packing of methylene blue. It can be easily uh, bought from the market um, your uh, veterinarian will uh, recommend you to buy methylene blue injectio so you will get this uh, medicine from the market and your uh, veterinarian will inject uh, intravenously into the uh, vein of the um, your animal to treat uh, and relax the animal from the complication relieve the animal from complications. Now, what is the prevention of um, uh, uh, this disease? In order to prevent, uh, first of all, prevent access to the nitrate uh, sources. In particular, prevent cattle getting in to the um, into it. For this, test your feed preferably before you begin to feed it to your livestock. Test your water that you give to livestock as well for nitrates. Number two, limit the amount of high nitrate feed going to the cattle and feed with other non or low nitrate feeds in replacement of the high nitrate feed. Number third, warm season grasses like Bermuda grass, sorghum, sorghum sudan and others are greatest risk for nitrate poisoning to your livestock. So avoid them. Here you can see. So it is all about the nitrate poisoning for today's lecture. Thank you very much. This is a summary of the topic of nitrate poisoning in cattle. Nitrate is converted into nitrite by the rumen. The nitrite is then converted into ammonia. Any excess of nitrite is absorbed by the bloodstream and then converted into methemoglobin. Drooling is the most important clinical sign of nitrate poisoning in cattle. On nitrate poisoning the blood acquires a chocolate color due to the presence of methemoglobin. Methylene blue is the drug of choice for the treatment of nitrate poisoning. Nitrate poisoning in cattle is a preventable condition. Large animal medicine. The diagnosis and treatment of nitrate poisoning in cattle.